Hey guys, welcome back. This is Tina and today I'm going to be setting up my November monthly um, view of my planner. Um, so I haven't brought it over yet. This is my, I'm going to call it, it's storage because um, I only keep current and maybe one extra month in my everyday planner. So this is... Um, where I store them all, and I will bring out November. These sticker books are the ones that I plan on possibly using for the monthly overview. I'm going to do a fall theme, and I even got um, ahead and put my goal sheet in the month, which I will do uh, maybe in another video. It may not make a video. I am still struggling with um, getting caught up with everything and um, taking care of the harvest and everything that we need to do and getting everything ready for winter. Um, it's been a little crazy. So let me make sure that is in there for you. Um, I do have a kid traveling right now, which is why some of my brain is a little like Man, because he's traveling by himself, but he's checking in every day, just either by text or by call. He's having a blast. My main thing is just safety. <laughs> um, oh, there we go. I know why I had this. I need to look and see what is going on this month. So are you guys ready for November? Because I completely am not. <laughs> I am not. Um, I have these. I'm going to work off of a lot of the Agenda 52. Um, these fun fall decoration uh, stickers that they have in here. This is, what is this? Seasonal foiled um, from Agenda 52. But, um, of course, I have my trusty black boxes. And then I have these, um, this is Recollections Fall and Winter. I will probably pull some boxes. And then I have this and a couple other boxes that I might pull because I need to do all my function stuff first. Um, let me make that go away. So what I'm gonna do first is, I think I'm gonna pick a color in here that kind of goes with this um, color scheme so that I can mark all of the because there's a lot of band um for basketball going on i guess so um i need to mark those days and i kind of would like to do it all in one color so that it all just kind of like when i see it i just know it's a band day so we've got four four days um of band which or band or something. Oh, okay. So this one is a concert. Ooh, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to have to look. All I know is she's got banned. My daughter's got banned. <laughs> so I'm going to have to mark those down. Um, so we're going to use, I think. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to use this one or this one. I think I'm going to use this one because I don't think I'll use too much else in this color. But this way I can get all of it marked down. So we've got the fifth and the twelfth. I don't know what's going on. I'm going to have to look because one of these. Oh, no, they don't have a concert until... Those are probably basketball games. I'm not sure. I don't think they have a concert until December. So the 23rd... Oh, look, Saturday. That's a Saturday. What the heck? Um, and then the 30th. That's another Saturday. Those are definitely basketball games. Definitely. Um, and then we have... Let me see what I got over here. Because I want to see what I have in um, boxes for this. I don't think I have very many. Probably don't have very many. But, yeah. I have I have like one and two. 
maybe three. But I don't like the gold, but I can fix that. Um, let's see, because I think I'm going to do this green one here, and I'm going to turn it over. And it does bring in some foil, but that's okay. So there will be that. Um, hmm, let's see. Oop, sorry. So once I get done, I'm going to bring in some washi because I need to mark off some um, testing dates. And let's see. Um, the 8th through the 10th. Okay, I need to pull in some washi anyway because we've got um, the play. So we pull in these here. And let me see if I can think of, I don't think, I'll do solid colors for my tests because that's just the way it's going to look better. Um, so let's go ahead and mark off. In fact, I might need to pick this one up. Um, where I'm looking on my list. Where is, oh, 27th to the 29th. Okay. So we're going to do Thanksgiving break here. Ooh, come on, there we go. And, haha, ha, look, I found both of them. I am so happy. I went without both of my, because I usually use one in my bag that I travel with. These, I love. They're six inch clear rulers. I've used this one for so many years that the, the hearts and the measurements are off, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm fine with it. Um, so I will keep those up there because I will use a, generally I'll use a little cheat sheet over here. And then, um, I'm going to use about the 8th, 9th, and 10th. We're going to use this as a little bit of decoration. In fact, I think I'm going to do this because I don't want it to be so thick. So, where is my... There we go. There's my razor. So I'm going to try to cut it in half because I don't need it so thick that it's taking up so much room and being such a large part of the decor. I just want something that will be able to mark it off. Nope. Okay. We've got this right here. This is the fall play that she's going to want to go see. Let's see if this will. That's good enough. Okay. That works. So that's the fall play. And then um, I'm going to need some more. Let's see. We're going to have, have these. Where is it? Give me a second. My desk quickly became a mess. Nope. Where on? Oh, there it is. Okay, this is it. So I'm going to pull some boxes, hopefully from here for autumn. Um, I don't need the decor, but I do need the boxes. So this one can go on the 22nd. Um, is your, like, this is starting to look really busy. <laughs> is your November this busy? Uh, mine is just going to keep adding. Um, let's see this. Oh, that is coming up fast. This is for the spell bowl. That competition is coming up fast for her. Um, I didn't even think it was coming up that fast. And then I have an appointment. And I'm going to, I think, pull this one. No, we're going to put that one back. I'm going to pull this, this one. And I think I'm going to cut off the gold because I don't need, I don't want that much gold. Oh, 
So if you've been around and you've been following, we now have one car fixed and one brand new to us car. Uh, so that is um, good for us. Um, the, the car issues are now closed with the insurance because everything's been fixed and taken care of. And my poor brain is just on overload. It's, it's slowly coming down, but I'm trying to um, do all the things that I know didn't get done this month because I was out dealing with car stuff. There's that, because we have a um, church Thanksgiving. Okay, so I want to get, we're going to get like um, two fallish colors, I think, of just solid washi. And I'm going, oh, I closed that. Why did I close that? Because I've been playing with the colors from here. I kind of like these. So I like this really dark blue. Which I think this one might go with. Let's see. So that one kind of goes with that, doesn't it? That blue right there. So we're going to use that one. And then I think we're going to do like a really... I don't want the teal. I want like a almost like a dark green, but I don't want to go too dark because it's not really all that dark. So I have this one and this one here. Ooh, why is that sticking? Because it's not, as you can see, this is a little uh, unorganized. So I'm thinking that lighter one is going to be more agreeable with it. Um, I think we're going to go with that. So I have... First set is from the, so I'm not sure I want to do this now that I thought about it, because I have from here to here, so I have these two weeks, and I think I'm just going to write them in over here when I'm done. Um, I'm just going to get a sticker and write them in. So I will, I will eventually write them in over here. I am not, because it's two weeks to take a test, um, a final. So I want to make sure. I've got the 27th to the 29th, the 5th, the 12th, the 23rd, and 30th. And then I've got the 19th. And then those are my testing days. And then we've got the 8th through the 10th. Oop, there's a hair. And then, let's see, the 22nd, and the 4th, and the 13th, and then the 17th. Okay, so if you are unfamiliar, I'm not going to show you a current one. Um, if you're unfamiliar, like what I'm looking at, I have this. Um, it's a future log, and it has the month at the top. And as things come up, I just randomly write them in the order that they come up. I don't write them in the date order, but it does tell me that when I am traveling, like if I'm at a doctor's office and they want to make something in a, another appointment three, four, five months out, I can say, oh, no, I can't do that day because I have another appointment. So I know not to schedule. Um, so I kind of want to do... I kind of wanted to do something about the purple, but I don't know if I want to do maybe something to lighten it up. I have this. So I can do a mushroom theme, or I can do like a peachy fall. I don't have, or I can do this. This might be, I don't know, it might be just too much because I don't have anything that that's that thick and solid. I have white, but I don't think that's going to cover it, though. I have the white checker. Oop, there we go. I might just have to live with it. And this, I'm um, like, two more months. Well, that does kind of take it down a bit. So let me, I'm going to do this because it's going to mute it at least. At the very least, it will mute the colors. I don't want to pull. 
I just want to lay it down so it'll mute them and it's not going to be as big. And I will trim this up in just a second. This way, it's not so big, bright, and in your face. There we go. Oop. Okay. So there's a hair that is hanging off because I probably didn't put it on straight. This one, I don't think it has as much room, which is why nope. make sure that is down. And then, um, if you're wondering, this is from uh, it's a Happy Planner Classic. Uh, calendar from last year. It's a uh, dashboard. Did I say classic? Um, it's a classic and it is from Grounded Magic is the uh, calendar name. I'm having a heck of a time getting this cut here. I think I have too much on my... Do, 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 do. There we go. There we go. I got too much stuff stuck on my, now my fingers, and then my scissors. So, having all kinds of issues. Let me go get my hole puncher. And I will get this one taken care of. Now, normally I would just use the crocodile, but since I did both of these all the way down, I'm going to use the um, hole puncher. And get them even. There we go. I always get nervous when I do that, but if you do those like I did those back to back, like the sticky sides together, the sticky part won't um, muck up your hole punch. So it's muted. So that's the best I can ask for for this. <laughs> um, let me see what I've got here because I'm going to start pulling things together decorative wise. So I'm going to put this because I covered up the Thanksgiving. Um, if I can get it off there. You know what? We're just going to pull it off because that's going to be easier. There we go. And this is from the um, Agenda 52. So I don't know if you can see that. I'm hoping you can because the reflection of the gold foil might cause a slight problem. I'm hoping you can see that. <laughs> um, let's see. So we've got, because I want to put some stuff up here. Obviously, I'm not going to put anything down here because there's, um, there's stuff. <laughs> So I think I kind of want to see pumpkin everything. And then there's one that says reasons to be thankful. So I'm going to, I think at the end of the month, I'm going to come back up and try to remember. Oh no, maybe I won't. <laughs> I did not think of that. It's going to uh, cover, nope, it's going to be covering up the uh, days of the week. That's not going to work. Let me see if I can't get this out of here so I can put it back on without a problem. Okay, see I've already mucked it up, but that's because that one, that one's there. That one, there we go. And this one that's coming up, I'm not too concerned. Come on. 
There we go. Come on now. There we go. And I got little tags and where is it? Here's a tag. Come on now. I probably should have done this before and off screen because or off camera. Because it's a little bit of a mess. Okay. So the sticker that came up that you saw coming up with the rest of the outline is um from another it's washi strip that didn't get used all the way and it was not sticking very well anyway. So we're gonna stick that one back on here and hope it sticks because I would like to use that on another day. Um so let's see. I think we might just do banner signs up across. So we've got that and happy fall. I'm just gonna interweave the, no oh my goodness. Okay, these are not made for happy planner um, sticker books. So we're going to cut that off a bit. Then we're gonna cut this off and it may be a little bit short, but I would rather it be too short than cover up my days of the week. Cause that's a little crazy. As I said, I probably cut it too, too short. Um, you know what? Which means these are probably all gonna be too uh, tall. We're going to put, might be re, designing some of this. Um, so we're going to put the uh, right side up, right side up. Um, I'll put this right across the middle here. And then I might change this one up. Yep. I'm going to do something different over here um, because this is not how I would like it to look. And I'm hoping this comes up without a problem. Probably might. It might not go back down the way I'd like it to. In fact, we're just going to move it down here. And I will work on more of this in a bit. Oop. Okay, so I have stuff stuck to my finger. Okay, so this says family, friends, and lots of food. Grateful, thankful, blessed. Gather around the table. I really like those. Um, I don't think, yep, there's not any over there and I don't have any on this one. So I'm going to put these and stagger them down and see how they look. Um, I don't know if I can stagger them because of the length. Okay. Maybe we, this one I can do this one. We're just going to cut the gold foil off to shorten it a bit. And the other ones, I'm not sure if I want to cut them, but we'll just make at least this one shorter. Oop. Okay. So this one I'm sticking up at the top. Oop, come on. There we go. And then I'm going to put this here. And I think it's going to stick off on both sides, but that's okay. And then I'm going to put this one in the middle. And it's going to stick off both sides, but that's okay. So it's going to look a little wonky. Oop, I might want to move that over just a hair because I don't want to punch that hole again. This one is taking a little bit longer than I normally do. And I'm sorry. Thank you for sticking around if you are still here because... I am not um, as with it as I normally am, and that's saying a lot because I'm usually scatterbrained anyway. So there, it's off the uh, pull. <laughs> uh, okay, so I don't want to do too, too much, but I do want to do this um, side down here, and I wanted to 
do plans for the season. I'm needing some notes to kind of some note areas. This is kind of why I wasn't concerned with it hanging off the edge because I knew I would be shoring up the edge there. And then we can put the happy fall because he looks like he's going to uh, come off the page anyway. And if you're with me normally, I, you know, you know, I don't normally just go straight down the side. I don't normally do any of that. Um, I think I'm going to put this cute little turkey guy. Do I have a smaller turkey guy? Yes, I do. I have a smaller turkey. So I'm going to put him right here because that looks like a cute little thing. And um, I'm going to see if I can't get the negative space off of here so that I can easily pick up the others. Maybe. Okay, there we go. So hopefully this will all come off easy without taking the stickers off. Nope, you can stay. Just gonna make using this page a lot easier, I think. And, oh, leave the little leaf. There we go. Sometimes, I don't always do this, but it's sometimes easier if you take off the negative space part of the sticker page. Then it makes it a whole lot easier to, um, move things around. Oop. So I'm going to put this up here because that looks really cute. And I thought I might, there we go. Mm, there's a couple, there's like pumpkins and leaves and I thought I would scatter them up on the top area and just let it kind of flow as being the month to eat your weight in turkey and pie, right? So, do they have, okay. So we'll do a pie. That is nothing I need. Um, oh my goodness. There's a wedge of pie and this, as I said, this is just to bring a little color up on the page. I really don't want to do a whole lot. I kind of wish there was something other than these orange leaves. Um, I can throw an acorn in there. Maybe two. Oh, I found another acorn. These are really on there. This doesn't want to come out. Maybe I'll use, oh, there's an orange acorn because we need more orange. I need some more like brown or green. Those are all, those are both facing the same way. Let's move that off to a different direction. There we go. Just to give it some change up. And let's see. I think I just want one more over here. And that kind of will balance things out a little bit. Um, I don't really want acorn. I don't want an orange acorn. There's a little one there. Let's see. Nope, nothing on the other page. Okay. So this is what we have. Mm -hmm. 
I think I'll bookend it with another pumpkin. And we can take an acorn. Kind of, oh look, we can put that over that. Nope, that doesn't look great. I was hoping, but I think if it was white, it probably, if I was on white sticker paper, it would have been much better. So we will move it off to the side there. And then I will take the leaf. We'll put that there. And I have this other little acorn. Now that one probably would have worked on that one, but I've already done that. So I will put this one over here. And I think I am happy with the way this turned out. So let me get my planner open to where it needs to be. And then bring y'all in. Um, if I can get, where is, where am I? This is nuts. Okay. That needs to go on that side. Okay. So I'm going to pull this in and then I will put the weekly pages in later. Okay. So this is, make sure it's all down. Um, this is my I'm going to call this a busy layout um, for my monthly. And that's okay. Some months are busier as far as like decor than others. Um, but I kind of needed these two boxes and I wanted to break them up. So um, that kind of worked out. So I hope that you are ready and uh, eagerly anticipating Thanksgiving and spending time with family. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it inspired you to get started on your October monthly layout so that you can see where your plans are aiming at. And I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.